I'm here with Alice Wong, and Alice is running for a school trustee with the City of Richmond. Alice, would you like to tell our viewers a little about yourself and why you're running for school trustee, mm -hmm. please? My name is Alice Wong, so I'm running for school board trustee with uh, Richmond Community Collection. So I'm a very a person to have a strong public school system in Richmond. So uh, I really believe that children is our future and they uh, deserve to have best and quality education for them. Good answer. Mm -hmm. um, Alice, it brings me to uh, COVID-19, which has had a huge impact on everybody, but particularly the health and well-being and the social life of our students. Mm -hmm. I understand that the students have asked the board for a voice at the table, whether it's a non-voting seat or whatever. They're the ones that are on the front line. Mm -hmm. They would like to have a voice at the board level so that the board members know what the students are challenged with. If, you're, if you are elected as a school trustee, how do you feel about this request? We are really, uh, at the front line as a school trustee, is really uh, open and uh, we, we really did go uh, have a transparent uh, consultation and uh, engagement for all the progress for the, all the stakeholders. And if still don't have a voice, if we are focused on two, they are really important for us to think about because students have their special thinking or anything as a concern about education. Mm -hmm. We need to concern about it. Of course. And if I have a, just like uh, we have a table 38, is a focus on the student leader to collect the, all the uh, school district students. And uh, now it's about our thinking is to have, a, maybe have a, a student trustee put a, is the long voting on our board meeting. That's a great yeah. idea. Yeah. Yes, I think so. Mm -hmm. um, diversity and inclusion means that all people have the right yes. to be valued and appreciated and mm -hmm. respected mm -hmm. as members of the school community. Mm -hmm. We know it's in the media all the time, the problems that the, the students do have with mm -hmm. bullying, etc. How would you, as a trustee, ensure the safety of these students while they're at school? We are uh, really support support is a safe uh, and healthy, inclusive uh, and learning environment in school. Mm -hmm. So um, just like we uh, have uh, our CMP liaison in the school, mm -hmm. uh, we have uh, uh, just like and the, con uh, con the counselor yes. yeah, in school. So we really, uh, encourage many ways can reach school uh, for the students. Yeah, and the parents is realize if any problem find it, is uh, coming out, it's really need to contact school for solve the problem of the student. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I hope so. Mm -hmm. I hope so. With fifteen candidates running for seven positions, mm -hmm. it's it's key that uh, the candidates do get their message out so the voters can learn who you all are and they yeah. can make their decision mm -hmm. based on an educated. Um, bit of knowledge that we're trying to provide for them. Yeah. In one word, what would you like to say to the viewers of why they should vote for you? So I'm the working hard people and uh, um, now is that uh, we uh, parents really trust me and encourage me to come out again to, to uh, for the school trustee. Well congratulations, yeah. you, you know I, I admire anybody who gives their time mm -hmm. to do community work and I think it's great that you uh, are willing to do that. Mm -hmm. I appreciate you being here today on, mm -hmm. and on behalf of Richmond Sentinel, I thank you for coming yeah, thank you. and all the very best on October 15th. Thank you very much.